Hello basketball coaches and basketball players, my name is Alan from Miles Basketball Training and today I am going to give you a basketball player that Dirk Nowinski drew up himself for the All-Star Game this year. There you go! So hello everyone, my name is Alan from Mel's Basketball Training. If you're new to this channel, on this channel I show you basketball plays, drills, and skills. So if you like that stuff, hit that like button and subscribe. But anyways, today I am going to give you a play that Dirk Nowinski drew up himself in the rookie sophomore game of this year's All-Star game. And well, it's a doozy. It's it's a simple play. I've seen it before. So it's, it's nothing like super special. But I thought I would bring it to you because of course Dirk is one of the greatest big players of all time. He is the epitome of what a uh, basically a stretch four or stretch five would be. So let's get down to the clipboard and let's check out this play. I'm going to break it down on the clipboard and then I'm going to show you the actual raw real footage of it and then I'll see you guys again. So first in this play, player one is going to pass to player three. This is just going to be a very simple touch pass back to player one. Player five is then going to set a back screen on player three who's going to cut towards the rim. Of course, player three may have an o option to be open. If he is, definitely hit him up. And then we're going to have player one dribble to the right side. And we're going to have player four setting a screen for player two. And player five is going to be popping up to the three-point line. We're then going to have player 3 move over to this spot where he's going to be grabbing the rebound. Player 2 is going to be moving in as well. And player 5 is going to be popping out towards the 3-point line where player 5 could be open for the 3-point shot. Or he could also pass to player 4 who's looking for a pass as well for the 3-point shot as well. We're going to have player 1 crashing the boards, player 3 and player 2 crashing the boards as well. And from there, this was a play that Dirk Nowinski drew up himself. Now let's see if this is going to work against the 2-3 zone, which is a zone that most likely you will be playing against if you do end up playing against a zone. So first we're going to have player 1 do a touch pass with player 4 and we're going to have a back screen on player 4. So most likely player 4 red would be up guarding player 4 blue and now player 4 blue is going to be cutting towards the rim. We're going to be having player one dribble out towards this side where now because of the zone, this is the corner of the zone or the attaching point of the zone. So this is going to be a double team over here. And we're going to be having a, a screen away or a back screen or a, just a screen for player two. Player five is going to be then popping up. And this is why we're looking for player two earlier because now what's going to happen, player five is going to get that ball for the shot. Player 2 and 1 are going to collapse on him, which now leaves player 2 blue open for a 3-point shot himself. And all three of these players are going to be crashing the boards, so that now we have an opportunity for a second chance point. Now let's look at the raw footage, and I'll see you guys in a second. Let me tell you something. Our transition defense is like I'm out there. We need to pick it up a little bit. We need to back a little better. We need to compete a little harder on the glass. There you go. Now this is a fantastic play. Of course, Dirk Nowinski is the one who had to have drawn this up because, of course, it's the number five player, the center, the postman, who's taken the three-point shot. I hope that you have enjoyed today's video. If you have, hit that like button, subscribe, and I will see you guys again tomorrow for another daily basketball video. And, of course, I want to say thank you to all my patrons from Patreon. Uh, everything is fantastic with me, and I hope it is with you as well. And uh, if you want to support me, go check out the link in the description. Description, and I'll see you guys again tomorrow.